Warning, the following content may contain elements that are not suited for all audiences. As of now, viewer discretion is advised. I went up again to the gloomy charm of post-apocalyptic Moscow. I was warned in the whole station about a new squad of Nazi rangers on the surface. But I meant to fulfill the last wish of the dead commander and send his message to Polis. Hello again, ladies and gentlemen. My name is John Boring, and once again, <clears throat> this is Metro 2033 Redux, part 13? Yes, sounds about right. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, we're actually about to enter my favorite level in the entire game. Well, one of them. Reason being that there, this level in of itself is very comprehensive and elaborate. Now let's go through it again. We have. This level. Has a lot of wide areas. A lot of narrow areas. But this level in of itself is all about stealth. Which is why I like packing this baby. Easy enough to move from cover to cover, but also, being that we're outside the entire time, things get a little more intense when you're trying to stay stealthy, but also, you're on time limit. So, you gotta be very careful with how you manage shit. Now, I don't care to do an all-stealth playthrough, because this is kind of what it is at this point, because I regrettably have just been kind of lacking on the walkthrough stuff, because I've been missing a lot of shit. But, hey, that's okay, right? Right. And let's just defy some laws of physics here. Now, if I wanted to, I probably could do an all-stealth uh, walkthrough, but I, I really don't care to at this point. I'm just having fun. <laughs> if I find something, I'll find it, and I'll try to do a better job of doing that. How did this... Gotta make that 
At some point I have to find a different gas mask because mine's cracked. And that could lead to a lot of problems. So... As we kind of discovered before, the surface is very toxic radioactive. And... Yeah, that... A lot of shit could kill you up here. <clears throat> Sorry. Everybody and their brother is trying to get a hold of me today. So I probably will be cutting a lot of this level out just because of... Well, it's extremely expansive. So... It'll probably take me a while to traverse from one part of the level to the other, getting through a couple firefights in the meantime. And new gas mask. Ammo. I remember how happy I was to see Bourbon in the empty city, another living human in the land of the dead. Where did that feeling go? Here on the surface, amongst the dead stones and petrified bones. Jan danger oozes from everything. The mutant animals, the irradiated soul, the poisoned air, and despite that, there's no greater danger than the, than man. As soon as, I, as we pry a tiny piece of living space from this hostile new world, we build a fortress there, not a peaceful colony. Human nature. On that note, sorry bud. Okay. Okay, I wasted more ammo than I should have. Almost didn't see you there. <laughs> This game wants me to die. Now, I don't remember everything about this game, but I know enough about it to just kind of give Whoa! Shit. Case in point. I get myself killed a lot. Actually, I believe there's... something I could do with you. I can do that real quick. Hmm. Yeah, I don't remember what it was I could do.
Oh well. Probably gonna cut that part out too. Shit! Uh, lose my footing all the time. So, let's move on. Poor guy. Cotton poor physics. <clears throat> there was something this way. No, uh, I'm wrong. No, that's long barrel, not suppressor. Not suppressed. Okay, so this is pretty much my only weapon for this. And unfortunately, I can't put out fires, so. Boo. I don't even understand what's going on with the physics at this point. Oh, he's behind the bookcase. Somebody definitely moved it. Didn't seem quite like the rats. Yeah, definitely not rats. They can't get headshots. I know, I'm sorry. I'll shut up now. Surely not. Neither are you. Mm, given the situation, I hate this thing, but I'll take it. Through here already. Forgot how underpowered that damn gun was. Bad time. Uh, 
Uh, there's about 50 billion reasons to hate this fucking gun. But... Beggars can't be choosers. Now, if only I had some more throwing knives. Another alternate route coming up that way. Shit, I'm not doing good on time. Crossing. Fucking hell. Huh. Wah! Ah, gotta love Nazi death traps. Balls. Okay, here's this objective complete. Need to see if we can make our way down. How to do that, I... Actually, I think I know. No, wait, that just took us in a circle. 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 
There we go. All righty, right, all right. Yeah, I'm not doing too good on filters right now, so. Damn those lights. There is playing it safe, and then there's playing this game where you honestly can't without dying. Well, Oh shit. <clears throat> Okay, like I said, bad on filters. Very bad. Oh, you had a throwing knife. More filters, thank you. Definitely need those. All right.
I think this calls for a little extra kick. Was it here? No, shit, I can't remember. This part always confused me. I can't remember what it was. Fuck. Um, here? Yes. Yes. It was clear that Black Station was occupied by fascists. But Olin had said he'd wait for me there. I had to risk it. And with that, I think I'm gonna call it a part right there. Um... Yeah, I... One of the main reasons why I like that level so much is because dark ambience, a lot of wind to cover up any sounds you make, Normally, I could stealth that no problem and still have about, I don't know, 15 minutes worth of air filters. But I, I just didn't feel like doing that this time around. It's just going balls to the wall for that one. So maybe someday I'll do an all stealth playthrough or something along those lines. But in the meantime, y'all have a nice day. Take it easy.